This eye look is gonna be pretty simple. I'm not gonna be doing um, nothing too much. I'm gonna go into my black radiance. You wish, girl, you wish you was at that part already. That's my favorite part. Contouring and highlighting is my favorite part of the makeup. But I'm gonna go into my BH Cosmetics 5th edition 120 color palette. I got this from Burlington for like $5.99 a year ago i don't know if they're still there but anyways i am going to be taking this shade right here and i'm going to use it as my transition shade <laughs> Now I am going to go into this pink shade right here and this is out of my NYX Brights palette. I know I need to get some more eyeshadows, but I'm like an online shopper, so, but I hate buying makeup online. I would seriously rather be at home all day and shop online rather than go into a store and shopping. Because I feel like when you go online, you actually get to go through everything that they have and pick. Like you don't skip over anything and then you don't have to worry about the lines. You don't have to worry about not finding your size. But the thing with makeup is that I would rather much go in stores because you can actually sample it. But I just, I don't know. I'm not that girl that just likes to go shopping. Go shopping in stores. I love shopping now, but I just, I would rather do it on my phone. I just thought about what I said when I said that contouring, highlighting and stuff was my favorite part. And it really is, but my favorite thing of makeup to buy is lipstick. I want something kind of grayish, bluish. In a way, I'm gonna be taking um the Color Workshop eyeshadow palette, and this is eyeshadow ELGP. My brother got this for me last Christmas. Okay, so I'm gonna take this shade right here, and I'm gonna place this on my lid. And I'm just gonna do a little bit at a time because I don't even know if that's such a good idea. Just want to kind of bring it into my crease a little bit so it looks like it just fades onto the lid. And I'm going back in with that pink brush. Blending it out. I'm gonna apply black to my lash line and I'm gonna be very careful with this because I don't want it to take away from what I did. eye first i don't know why this eye always comes out better than this eye and i'm right-handed so you would think the right side of my face would be my best side right nope it's my left side just gonna apply one coat of mascara put on my lashes and i will be back with you guys
So I'm going to take that blue that I used, this one right here, and I'm going to use this flat brush right here, and I'm going to just pack this directly on my waterline, and then I'm going to smoke it out with this pink right here from my NYX palette. Drop a roll at the park cushion, please. I don't need you seeing your thing on her knees. What if I'm in this forget I'll just uh we even gonna make it to this club? I'm gonna go in with this color workshop eye pencil in its dark blue. I don't know if you guys can tell. I'm gonna put that on my other one. The lips, I am going to outline with that blue lip pencil. So now I'm going to be taking a Maybelline Vivid Matte it's in the shade 55 Sinful Stone. So I feel like I could still see my lips underneath the lipstick. It look kind of spacey. So I am going to go back in with that blue lip pencil and pull it, put it all over my lips and then go on top with that lipstick. And I know my lips was dry too, so maybe that was the reason why. That's really cute. I was not expecting this color, but it's really cute. I really like that color. I'm just gonna outline with black. some glitter on my lips but I think not like this color is legit bomb I'm gonna go over my highlight with a more champagne whitish type of highlight I feel like the look that I got will look whoa better with that Tongue. Like I was just eating that shit. Mm -mm. But yeah, you guys. <laughs> 